folks, this is Lisa Ann Ross, and I decided that today, because we can't be together physically, I would put our warm-up, our daily warm-up, on video so that we can be together in spirit while we all do our daily artistic practice in our own spaces while we're social distancing. So this warm-up is the warm-up that uh, I do with my students at St. Thomas University, my amazing, amazing students. And this is an amalgamation of many different warm-ups that I have collected over the years. Uh, Marie-Josée Chartier, a little shout out to you because you're the person that I learned from most recently. And so I took some of this uh, directly from you. Susan Stackhouse did a voice and speech workshop with her uh, like a year and a half ago, loved a whole bunch of things that she did. And of course my students on a daily basis influence what I do and they bring things to me. And so we've almost created this collectively. So in a sense, this is our warm up. And so we would like to share this warm up with you. And I hope that this helps you to find a little bit of balance and maybe is a springboard for creation during this difficult time. Okay, so let's get going. So we always begin on purpose. Everything that we do, every time we enter the class, we begin on purpose. We let go of what has come before, we let go of what is to come after, and we place ourselves firmly in the space so that we can work with open hearts and focused minds. So you can't see my feet because I couldn't figure out how to show my whole body, but whatever. I need, a, I need some tech support. So what I want you to do is put your feet hip distance apart, whatever that means to you. And let's just take a moment to press those feet into the floor. And then let's just pick up those toes. Again, you can't see my toes, but oh, I'm picking them up. And you want to stretch those toes out. And then I want you to stretch your fingers at the same time. And then we're going to press our hands and our feet down into the ground. And then let's find our soft focus. So soft focus is looking at everything, nothing. Right? So you're not focusing on anything in particular. So a nice soft focus. Tuck that chin a little bit. And then let's take, drop that pelvic floor. Let's take a big inhale in together. A big exhale yourself sink into the floor on the exhale letting go coming further into the space another big inhale in together dropping it into the belly hold it at the top and a big exhale and then one final big inhale with a soft focus hold it at the top little sip Little sip, and let it go with a big audible exhale. Good, and then let those eyes gently close on that audible exhale. Closing your eyes isn't available to you. Just find a point a few feet in front of you on the floor. So let's take a journey through the body. Again, Let's just lift up those toes, stretch them nice and wide, and then press those feet back into the ground. Let that belly go and make sure the breath is continuing. So let's begin with the feet. Let's open up the portals of those feet and allow the energy of the earth to come up through the floor, the foundation, through the frost, and to enter through the portals of our feet. You can give that energy a color. And I want you to imagine that light energy rushing up into your feet and it's replacing any tension with energy, readiness, and lightness. Allow that energy to roll up through the feet. It's rolling up through the ankles, replacing tension, worry with energy, lightness, and readiness. Rolling up through the front of the calves back of the calves, rolling up through the back of the knee, rushing over the front of the knee. Remember to put a slight bend in the knee to protect that lower back. And then rising up through those big thigh muscles. Feel that light energy rushing up through the earth, replacing tension with energy. Those runner's legs, remember, as if we're at the starting block of a race. And when the gun goes, we're just ready to run. 
We have no tension. It's just energy, readiness, and lightness. Then rolling up into the center, dropping that center, letting that belly be nice and free so that the breath can drop in, and then rolling up through the belly. Feel that energy wrapping around to the back of the body. And let's begin with the journey up the spine, beginning at the base of the spine, at the tailbone. And let's take a journey up those lumbar spine, putting energy, space, and lightness between each lumbar spine. And then feel that energy wrapping around again to the front of the body. Again, releasing the lower ribs, releasing the belly again, feeling that energy wrap back around to the back. Working with the mid-back and feeling energy and lightness between each of those vertebrae. Feel that energy wrapping around again to the front of the body. Feel that carriage expanding. Feel lightness and energy filling the lungs. And then again, feel that energy wrapping around behind the back. Feel the energy and lightness creating space and openness between the vertebrae in the upper back. And then finally, feeling that light energy rush all the way up to the collarbones. It crests and then pours down the arms, taking with it any tension and replacing it with energy and lightness and readiness. And it rushes all the way to the fingertips, releasing the fingertips and feel any tension just drip off the end of the fingertips and go rolling away. The end of our journey, coming back the cervical spine, those seven cervical spine, feeling lightness and energy as we travel up. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, lengthen the back of the neck, and then feel that energy rushing over the top of the head, flowing down the front of the face, feeling those eyes relax in the sockets, feeling the nasal cavities relax, feeling the jawbone relax, and finally taking that tongue and allowing it to disengage from the roof of the mouth and float down to the floor of the mouth, taking with it the lower jaw, creating space between the teeth and the lips. Beautiful. I'm going to count to three. We're going to open our eyes. We're going to find our soft focus, but we are going to maintain this strong, focused body. One, two, three, opening the eyes, maintaining that focus, feeling that connection between all of us who are doing this warm up, feeling that energy, feel the energy of your heart center rushing out into the world, making connections, connecting with the audience, the gods, your company members, take a deep inhale. Big audible exhale. Uh, and then let's shake that out. Uh, uh, uh. Uh, good. Oh, that felt good. I haven't done that for a couple of days. And that felt really, really nice. So I'm just coming over my computer because there. Okay. You can see me again. I can see myself again. That was wonderful. So that is how we begin our daily practice in the studio every day. And you know what, I think I'm going to stop the video here so that we can do it in chunks. So thank you so much for doing that with me. And I hope that all of you use this. It's a great way to begin the day, a great way to ground yourself uh, before you do any kind of work, any kind of artistic practice, academic practice, any kind of work. Anyway, from my students and myself to you, I hope this is helpful. Okay, I'll be right back.